Hello friends, our today topic is contrary motion. Uh, people, those who play piano, keyboard, they, it's very familiar to this one. It's very easy for them to understand what we are talking about. It's just that that you go in opposite directions. So music moves in contrary motion. It two apart apart move away from one another or towards one another. So keyboard player often plays scales in contrary motion. Here is a C major scale in contrary motion. So if I if I if I want to show you from through the keyboard, so contrary motion is like you start you start with the both thumbs on C imagine and then you go open it like that and then you come back. So they're going opposite and they're coming back to each other. So that's called a contrary motion. You're gonna go that. So uh, same way the last topic I told you about the similar motion. The similar motion was I told that's a one octave apart. So in that one you start if this is a C you start from this C then other hand will start from this C. And then you move like that in one direction then you come back so they always go parallel they will never cross back like a contrary can come back but they will not in the similar one they will not come uh, cross together okay so let's do according to theory you can see they're going away from each other and then they're coming towards each other okay so let's straight away go to the exercise it's simple not to be worried about this topic so they're saying write two more repeat of these bars to make ostinati these move in contrary motion so we have to repeat the uh, uh, bars again because they are already showing in the contrary motion okay so we just have to repeat it again so let's just do it this is one second and third so if you see uh, this motion you can see they both are starting on center middle C and then they're going away from each other. I'll show it to you on keyboard as well, like on paper. So if you see in a simpler way, if you both, you keep your thumb on C, so you from C, it goes to D and then goes to E. So you can see one, two, three, so C, D, E. So they're going opposite to each other okay and same way they can come back again now next question uh, you can see this starts with the D so let's go to the D then they go to A and they go to B again so D A and D stop it and this one is D, A, D. D, A, and then D. Let's put this turn. Okay, so let's finish this one. Yeah, let's check. Okay, the last exercise of this topic we have starting this treble clef. This is B, D, F, and again B, B. Yeah. Okay, let's put the stem down.
Okay. So here we finish with this topic. Now I'll see the next topic. Thank you so much, guys. Take care.